Wenger keeps door open to management with eyes on specific task at some stage. Ex-Arsenal boss Arsene Wenger has refused to rule out a return to management after three years and counting away from the dugout after leaving the Gunners in 2018. Wenger spent 22 years in the Arsenal hot seat before eventually calling time on his managerial career amid huge pressure from fans to leave his post after years of what supporters viewed as underwhelming performances. The Frenchman's entire managerial career actually spans across 37 years, Wenger enjoying successful stints in charge of Nancy as Monaco and J-League side Nagoya Grampus 8 before arriving in North London in 1996. He would go on to become the first foreign manager to win the Premier League, securing a historic league and FA Cup double in the 1997-98 campaign. Have your say. Would Wenger be a success if he returns to management? Comment below many had believed that his departure from the Gunners at the age of 69 marked the end of Wenger's time as a boss, but the three-time Premier League winner has caused quite the stir with his recent comments. Speaking at the UK premiere of his film Arsene Wenger Invincible, the former Arsenal boss was asked whether he sees a return to the dugout anytime soon. I'm crazy, I'm crazy enough to be crazy and to make a crazy decision, Wenger responded. But overall I would say no, I am determined at the moment not to do it, maybe a national team at some stage for a term. At the moment, I am involved in projects with FIFA and want to get to the end of it, yesterday we launched an academy online to give a chance to everybody in the world to develop as a football player that is, for me, more useful now. I made 1,235 games for Arsenal and overall in my career 2,000 games, if I manage 10 more it will not change my life. Which Premier League manager is most likely to face the sack next? Vote below since his Arsenal exit, Wenger has enjoyed a new role as FIFA's head of global football development, though much like his Arsenal reign, it has not been without controversy. The 72-year-old has been a driving force behind the campaign to change the time frame of the FIFA World Cup from one tournament every four years to one every two. The overwhelming majority